garage today. The weather's not cooperating. I was going to service the lawnmower. I don't guess I'll get the oil changed on it today or can get it cleaned. I got it covered in grass here. But maybe I can get this new discharge chute I bought the other day bolted on here. I had my old one welded together, but it didn't hold. I bang it and bump it so hard when I'm going around trees and stumps. But it probably won't take me long to break this brand new one either. I'm going to sit down here and on the floor in the dry. See if I get this new one bolted on there. Some kind of tree frog or something up in the rafters croaking. I thought it might be a big bird or something. I don't know how a bird would have got in here. Looks like I got a carter key to take out of there. I probably got enough tools to do that right here in my hand. I had this bungee cord on there just so I could lift it up and get around things. It'd be nice if they had a little lever you could just flip and lift that up out of the way where you can cut close to something. But the bungee cord will work some. I don't know if I want to drill a hole in the new one or not. There we go. Okay, the spring goes behind that ledge right there. At this point in the process of taking this thing apart, I didn't pay attention to this spring right here. The other end of the spring being on the outside edge of this discharge chute. And it wound up costing me a good 10 minutes to figure out how to put it back together. So be sure this spring right here is on the outside. Straighten the carter pin. Get a grip on it. Pull it out. Nothing to it. All right. Wrong a hammer. There we go. How was that? Looks like. Looks like it was right up in there. Should have paid more attention, huh? trying to put this on without putting this clip over on the top side and it's spring loaded so you got to take a pair of pliers and keep that spring in line where you can drive that pin in there with this spring behind that lever like that to give it some spring so come back down otherwise it just flops up and down and it don't have any spring tension but I got it on there and I'm not taking it back off it took me 10 minutes to figure out how it goes
straight enough for railroad work. One Carter key bent. Bent real good. Bend that one a little bit too. Maybe I won't. There we go. Need to take my air hose and blow this thing off out there, but it's raining too much. Yeah, that old discharge chute was tore all the pieces. Where I welded, it didn't hold. But it was only a temporary attempt to keep it going anyway. Got another gear out of it with my little welding job. I don't think I'll put my bungee cord on there right now. I don't want to drill a hole in it. Then again, I don't want to break it again either. I'll bring my drill out here and drill a hole in it somewhere. So I can just reach and grab that bungee cord and lift her up. That's how it got broken in the first place. I was running into things. 